What's up guys, GGB is good here, and you've tuned in to the second part of the week of Mr. Game & Watch. If you haven't tuned in before, this is a three-part series for every character, where I choose one character each week, and do one-on-one -on -one matches online for glory. Today's character is Mr. Game & Watch. Um, he's a real, uh, I'm horrible, let's, I'm just gonna be very blunt with you guys, I'm horrible with Mr. Game & Watch. But I'd also like to say that if you'd like to see a particular character next week, besides the general order of characters, so the next one will be Little Mac, um, please leave your character selection in the comment section below. I will go ahead and choose that character next. Oh, there's good old Little Mac. God, I'm playing someone in Japan, but... That means there's going to be a lot of lag. <laughs> Unless we both have good internet connection. You think... Oh. They have better internet connection in Japan. Maybe it's... I mean... Who knows? Actually, it's working out just fine. Ha! That <coughs> couldn't have worked out better. I would totally did that on purpose. Just so you know. You're not going to run towards me? He is going to run towards me. Goodbye, Little Mac. Alright, I mean, that was sort of a horrible way to start off the second part of the week of Mr. Game Watch, but I'll take the win. It's pretty awesome. Alright, he doesn't want to play me anymore. Will we... Ah, oh, shoot, that was stupid. Anyways... We'll go back in. Each pillar supports a part. All right. So, Mr. Game & Watch is a 2D character, and I believe could be one of the first video game characters uh, ever, as far as I... I mean, I wasn't alive back then, but uh, and I don't know many, peop many gamers that were alive back then, to be honest with you. But that's just because I am not that old. <laughs> I'm sure there was a communication error, Nintendo. You don't have to tell me. Alright, T-Bone, we got a we got a match here. I think White Mr. Game Watch looks the coolest. Aside from Black Mr. Game Watch, classic Game and Watch. Try to switch it up every now and then. Anyways, T Bone will be our enemy today. Let's see if we can. Sweet, he has good connection. Or at least it looks like it. So I like to give um, people the best two out of three. Uh, because I think that you can beat anyone in Super Smash Brothers at least once. Or at least this Smash Bros. Uh, I don't know about Melee. Melee is a game of skill. This game is a game of skill, don't get me wrong. But, you know, sometimes you screw up, sometimes you do. Sometimes you don't. Most of the time you don't. Most of the time it's just your fault. <laughs> like that, definitely my fault. Because I'm not paying attention, and I also... But also, more importantly, I suck as Game Watch. But I was I was saying this um, in the last part. I think that Game Watch has a horrible matchup against the faster characters in this game. I don't think he can act as quickly as them. Um, and he has some awkward movement issues that I just don't like at all, personally. But, the point of this series is to play with every character at least one week online. So obviously, Zero Suit Samus is a very fast character, and a very deadly one, so she's just going to tear through me. I will totally take that rematch, though.
I was also just <coughs> streaming uh, Super Metroid last night, which was totally awesome. Um, so go ahead and check that game out. Not necessarily me playing it, but uh, go ahead and check Super Metroid out if you haven't ever played it before. I can only suggest you play that game if you are at all interested in any uh, Metroid game. I say go check that one out. Or, of course, the original Metroid. But I think Super Metroid's a better game. That was weird. Is that because of my up air move? Does that move transcend space and time? That was so far away. Whoa, the grabs, the grabs. <laughs> I wasn't gonna make it anyways, that was crazy. I didn't know that move spiked at all. Yeah, he's very good with Zero Suit. She's probably one of the better characters in the game in terms of combos. She definitely has uh, a lot of her moves linked together, obviously. That's what a combo would be. And um, she's super quick and agile in the air. Just an all around good character, although she's rather light, so her defenses are not the best. I had my key out, ma'am. You can't up B through my key. I guess you can, obviously. So the key does not give you full immunity. You think it would. Alright, let's go ahead and leave T-Bone because he's bodying me, and also, he just destroyed me. Twice, rather than just once. I would like to keep playing him and change characters, but the whole point of this is to play this Mr. Game Watch. Hero, Brandon. Alright, Brandon, let's play. Yeah, Game & Watch's tilts are not the best. I don't think they're very good. I don't really like any of his moves, to be honest with you, except for his down smash. And his neutral air is good. It has pretty good range, and it hits below him too. It just hits 360 degrees around him, wherever the fish go. Good grab there by Hero. Hero! You think that's. Is that how you spelled Hero? No. That must have been H I R O. Hero from um, Gundam Wing. Is that how you spell his name? Obviously, it was a Japanese name, so. But the English writing of it. Probably not how you pronounce it, really. Anyways, back to back to Super Smash Brothers. So yeah, you can sort of throw your opponents off. That was awesome. I didn't know he picked that up by using that up uh, up aerial move because they might not be expecting it. Nice, I actually got a kill. That was actually a decent kill with Game of Watch. So his aerials can kill, you just gotta have higher percentages on your opponents than... Game of Watch isn't that strong, so you gotta get some damage in somehow. I guess maybe by throwing some bacon around, some fish. It's not the strongest move, however. Just like, probably 1% each, maybe 2. Oh, <clears throat> that sucked. Got stuck under it. He dodged my air blow. Alright, we're putting pressure on this guy. Which is nice. You want to keep the pressure up with Game & Watch 
to throw your opponent off of uh of course that might be hard to do because he's not the easiest character to use i'm finding but as always this is a learning experience his dash isn't that fast his grab isn't that fast but He can kill if you put, a, put on the pressure. His moves come out at awkward times, they're just awkward moves in general. He's a unique character to say the least, but I took that kill. Nice. I actually did well for once. <laughs> Let's go again. Hero, your connection is halfway decent and you let me destroy you. <laughs> Brandon, rather. It looks like the key does around 14 damage. 14, 15 damage. Oh, that's cool. I love Mega... Mega Man... Everyone's been hating on Mega Man, but... Now it seems like he's been popping up a lot more. He's not a bad character, man. People just needed to learn how to use him. I've been recently playing through Mega Man 3, an excellent game. Some would say the best Mega Man game, but of course that uh, is up for debate. Mega Man 2 is probably better. But... Ah... Uh, how annoying. You can die to that pretty- I'm sure that's actually a deadly move when fighting against Game & Watch, come to think of it. Because he's so light. Yeah. Sweet, hit him with that. Alright, so... That's good to know. All right, I'll take that kill. Um, oh, I always get thrown off by Mega Man's forward smash. Um, that was good. It's good to know that Game & Watch's forward air uh, stays out for a long time and the hitbox does as well. But it's obviously strongest uh, right when it comes out. So if you want to kill with it rather than just hit with it, um, if you want to knock them out of the ring, rather than just off the stage, um, rather than just keeping them off the stage. This guy is jumping all over the place. That's how you should be playing Mega Man. Um, you should throw it out earlier rather, rather than later. Obviously on time would be great. Oh man, those were some good games. <clears throat> I might play this guy a third time just for fun. Good games, heroes. Hero, Brandon, we will play again. Oh, the, the Zelda... Oh, Alright, well, we're playing Jake now because Brandon... Had didn't want anything to do with me. Game Watch can totally teabag also. It's pretty awesome. <laughs> so yeah, I'm sort of shying away from Game Watch's special moves because I'll do the same thing to you, Link. Uh, because they're kind of... Grant, his side B move is done by chance. Granted, it does come out pretty quickly, but you never know how you're going to hit them, so what's the point of using it? You know? I mean, use it for fun, sure, but... Like I am, but you never know if you're actually going to hit them with a considerable amount of damage, or if you're just going to tap them, you know? Or if you're going to cause a status element or something. Um, his neutral B move is 
has an awkward arc towards it. Some t it's also random too. I mean, I think when it's useful when uh, they're close to you because the fire, the frying pan actually does some damage. Um, Just use it. I don't know why you want to do that so badly. <laughs> what are you? Who the fuck are you? <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> God. Anyways, his tilts stay out for a while, so you gotta be careful with those. You're really one of those people that does the down air every time you're on top of me. Is that really what you want to do? Do it. Like, I I literally countered it every time. Why would you continue to do it? I don't know. I mean, this game is... Maybe he's just trolling. I don't know. There's a whole bunch of trolls that lurk around the Super Smash Brothers. I don't know. Which is totally fine. Don't get me wrong. Trolls on the internet, go for it. You're having fun. I'm in good spirits, so I'll also have fun. Oh, he actually got me with it, so never mind. Maybe that was his whole scheme. Oh my god. Do it. Yeah, so you can see his range on his... We got a good freeze frame of his range on the <laughs> forward smash, huh? <sighs> Alright, I don't want to lose this match because I'm dicking around because there's so much lag right now. I gotta get rid of this guy and not play him again. Oh, I almost hit him. <laughs> Alright, got rid of him. Now we don't have to play him anymore. And we can most likely... I guess we'll end it on a... End this part of the week of Game & Watch on a positive note where we actually won. <laughs> so I'm going to go ahead and end this part of the Game & Watch part of week of... Uh, right here. So thanks so much for watching guys. Leave a thumbs up if you like the video. Leave a thumbs down if you didn't like the video. And why don't you go ahead and hit the subscribe button. Um, uh, until then, until next week, or until actually until the next part of the week of Game Watch, I'm GGB's good and I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.